Welcome back, everybody. Oh, fire! Somebody call fire department. Oh, good. They're here. Oh, wow. That was a close one. Well, this is my collection of fire trucks. This is a collection I've been building over the years. Haven't actually been uh, actively searching for them, but I did find a few cool ones throughout my uh, collecting uh, life. Uh, <laughs> that was since 88. I found uh, some very cool ones. Well, let's start with these ones here. These, these are by Hot Wheels. And uh, I'm not sure uh, what they were calling this particular casting, but as you can see, this is a Carpet 74. It's a Hong Kong US patent. Uh, and it's an old one. And pretty cool. Uh, I found this used, obviously. But, you know, uh, of course, uh, it's a cool older casting. Uh, here's a newer casting of the same vehicle. It is now uh, made in Malaysia. Uh, still has the copyright 74 date on it, but as you can see, uh, they covered up the name and made in Malaysia down below. And this one had been issued many times in different liveries. And uh, while well, I've got different colors of it, and but I thought I'd just include the red one here. So that's pretty cool. Now, uh, a lot of these are matchbox, but I'm going to show you the non-matchbox first. So we put those aside. And of course, this is a classic old number five. And uh, there's other versions of it. Some have uh, louvers on the side of the hood there, but uh, this is a cool old one. Uh, this one is a Hong Kong base as well. Yeah, so that's pretty cool. So original copyright 1980. Yeah, pretty nice. It's got metal chassis and metal body. And uh, this one I found used in really nice shape. So that's always uh, cool to find. Uh, lots of metal in this one. So very cool, classic Hot Wheels casting. And then, well, let's uh, look at another Hot Wheels here. Uh, this is the Fire Eater. Now, they were calling some of these by certain names. And as you can see, there it says Fire Eater. Yeah, it's an older casting. Well, copyright 76. It's a Hong Kong base, and uh, I'm not sure if this is an original one. But still, it's a very cool one. Nice tempo work on it. And the interior is all part of the window unit. But that's pretty cool there. Nice little fire engine. Put that off to the side. Uh, another Hot Wheels. And this is the airport fire rescue fire department. Uh, pretty cool. It still has these on top. Uh, there's a little piece broken off on the front one. But still, that looks pretty cool. I like that. Uh, let's see. Uh, there's the bottom there. So obviously this is a reissue because uh, the former... Uh, place it was made and it's covered up and now it's stamped Malaysia so cup rate 79 was when this casting uh, first appeared 79 or 80 and that's in beautiful shape temples are a little worn but otherwise uh, you know pretty nice shape so that's a good one to have and then here's uh, one from Road Chaps and uh, I'll just tilt it over Show you the chassis there. So this one's copyright 1990. And metal chassis, metal body. And very cool. The American LaFrance fire engine. Although it doesn't have the actual name of it on the chassis. But very cool by Road Champs. Interior is part of the bumper unit. So that's good. So you got a nice chrome bumper up front. Very nice casting. You got ladders there, and then you got this big, big boom, I guess. Uh, that's what you call it. And then it's got the end of the hose there. <laughs> so that's really neat. Of course, it pivots around. And then we uh, put it down like that. So that's pretty cool. And then we have a majorette. That's pretty cool. This extends out, although it doesn't want to stay up. But very cool little major red here. And it's got spring suspension. 
And there's the chassis. Pompier. And so that's a very nice one. That would be a newer American LaFrance. And so pretty cool there. That's really nice. Uh, this one I got used and it's in nice shape. And so it's always nice when the lights on top are still intact and not worn down. And then the next one here. Uh, this one is a play art. Oop. And it is another Hong Kong base. So that's pretty cool. And uh, well, the ladder moves up and it slides in and out although this does come off luckily that never got lost and it does have spring suspension not not much but still a very cool one and this is the Merriweather uh the uh yeah Merriweather fire engine and uh how do i know that well, I got the Matchbox version right here. <laughs> and this is a very cool one. Now, the ladders don't move on this one. And uh, it's an older casting. Now, look at the chassis here. So, made in England, less new products. Car rate is 69, but it's got a plastic chassis. So, I'm not sure if they actually made them in 69 with plastic chassis. So, this is a later issue, definitely. And it's in very nice shape. It's got the paper decals. It's like the old... Uh, Matchbox and Corgi used to have. And this is in beautiful shape. So, gotta love that one. And obviously, two different scales, but still very cool to have both of these. And then we'll look at the Matchbox. Well, let's look at a newer one. Uh, this one they're still making. This is one I collected after Mattel bought matchbox so you see it's a 98 mattel ink and very cool casting nice temple work very cool one there try not to crash these all and uh well let's look at uh this one would be another the next newer one i guess and uh, very cool there. So you see the ladder moves up and down and then it spins around. So that's really cool. Uh, pretty cool cab on it. Let's see the bottom there. Fire engine, cup rate 82. And this probably isn't the first edition. But it's a cool addition. You see the light's still sticking up there. So I found some great ones. Still in beautiful shape. So put that aside. And then we've got some well, fantasy vehicles. But still very cool. This one's in beautiful shape. And the ladder goes up and down. It's got the paper decals still on. And it's got a unpainted base so blaze buster number 22 super fast uh, cup rate 73 75 whatever and very cool there and then i've got a rougher shape and the ladder well i don't know i guess it's uh melted deformed or maybe that's the way it was i'm not sure but this one's uh got a black painted base on it So even though this looks older, this might be the oldest one here. But very cool to have both of them. And let's see, here's another one. This is another very cool matchbox. Love this with the Peterbilt cab. Look at the chassis here. I always do it upside down for some reason, but. So cup right, um, 84. Four, it looks like and I don't think this is an 84 casting but very cool so you got the the arms that swing out to support the 
the crane, basically, with this tall extension ladder. Well, anyways, <laughs> I won't pop it in, but very cool there. So love that one. Let's put that aside. And well, let's. I think this is uh, the next. This one's really old. Uh, this one is a very cool GM cab. Although they don't say it on the chassis, it's just a snorkel fire engine. But it's based on uh, the square body truck. And very cool there. I found this used in beautiful shape. And then we get this guy up here, fireman. And so that's really cool. And of course, it folds down and then that tucks right in there. So very nice casting. Love that one. And always cool when it's got metal body and metal chassis. And we have, go to a really old one. This goes back to the 60s. And I found this at a toy show. And it's in beautiful shape. It didn't compass it too much. Uh, here's the chassis here. So this is uh, made in England by Lesney. Matchbox series. Number 29. Fire pumper truck. Very cool casting. Love this one. And look how fine that ladder is. And molded in plastic but it's part of that unit there but very cool very nice little casting and just the fine little uh sirens bells on the front so gotta love that one and then of course you gotta have fire chief cars right so here's two cool ones and this goes with that series of fantasy castings did I do this right? Yes. So we got the Fire Chief, number 64, made in England, super fast. Cup rate, 76, it looks like. Very cool there. And that one's in beautiful shape. I found that at a thrift store. And when you can find them in great shape like that, then that's a big win. And here's another old casting. Uh, this one I got for a dollar. Well, somebody, I think this was at a garage sale. That's why you see that. Or I don't know. It might have been a thrift store. It's been a long time ago. It's, but it's the Mercury. And uh, let's see. Oh, it's part of the super fast line. So there you go there. That's pretty cool. So there you have my cool fire engines. I still have my cool trucks here. These are cool matchbox, and of course, it's nice whenever you get the moving parts. So there you go. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoy this, and I'll catch you in the next one.